MJF beats Will Osprey for AEW international title and buzzer beater before our time limit draw, Tony Khan has booked numerous high-profile matches, and the MJF vs Will Osprey bout is one that would typically receive a lengthy build-up. Surprisingly, the match was announced last week, and fans got to witness it tonight. The match featured intense action, including high spots and crowd interactions. MJF employed relentless submission holds to wear Osprey down. The competitors also paid homage to wrestling legends, with MJF mimicking Rick Rude and Osprey channeling Ric Flair. During the match, Osprey appeared to injure his shoulder while attempting an Ozcutter on the apron. Despite the setback, he continued and regained control of the match, prompting fight forever chance from the crowd at the 30-minute mark. Near the match's conclusion, MJF and Osprey brawled in the crowd, with MJF giving a child the middle finger and Osprey encouraging the girl to slap him. After returning to the ring, they exchanged near falls, with the crowd erupting in this is awesome chance. Osprey hit MJF with a top rope Oscutter and a forbidden blade, but MJF kicked out. With less than a minute remaining, Osprey prepared for a Tiger Diver 96 but hesitated, allowing MJF to shove him into the referee. MJF then used a hidden object to secure the pinfall victory with just one second left on the clock. After the pin, it was revealed that MJF had his dynamite diamond ring on for that knockout blow. This match marks a new chapter in MJF's career as international champion, and it remains to be seen how both wrestlers will move forward. Friends, what are your thoughts on AEW's booking for Dynamite? Would you have given Will Ospreay vs MJF a bigger build? Share your opinions in the comments below.